morning today i am going to show new os it's a zorin os so it's a uh, zorin os is very nice uh, just i want to show once so here uh, open any browser and just type there as z o r i n os so after uh, typing just you can see here uh, make your computer better zorin os zorin os is alternative to windows and mac os so here uh, designed to make your computer faster more powerful secure so uh, if you want to make your uh, computer faster just go to this uh, os uh, it's an uh, having new advanced features also there uh, zorin os prime also is there pro version is there in that you can just uh, you can directly go for mac and uh, windows uh, and linux you can try entire three things in this uh, zorin os so play thousands of games and here you can see many features are there see here you can see dual boot uh, install zorin os along windows and mac os and keep your files and apps you'll be able to choose os here i'm just scrolling and i'm showing download zorin os is there just click on it and here you can see pro version is also there and uh, many features are there in pro version just so we can try for once uh, once you can try see here you can see zorin os 16.3 core and the light is there so download for free so it's absolutely free so you can go to this uh, versions subscribe and download skip to download so i am clicking on it and uh, thanks for downloading see here you can see my download has been started your download should be in automatically it will take some time and uh, after that you have to just open aga uh, again the browser and type there as rufus to boot you have to use rufus so rufus is there and scroll down and there you can see rufus 4.3 exe so every time i choose that standard windows x64 a uh, 1.4 mb so i just uh, continue downloading and i am going for rufus download and here you can see zorin os on uh, desktop and uh, just to open uh, and see in downloads whether your zorin os and rufus has been there or not just i am keeping it in uh, desktop rufus open rufus you have to open rufus and you have to do boot so just take uh, 8 to 16 gb capacity pen drive see here i am taking sandisk 16 my pen drive and now i'll open rufus and after opening rufus uh, we have to do you want to allow rufus for applicant uh, updates no i don't need uh, for uh, updates so just don't go for any updates it will take some time here i installed sandy 16 my pen drive and uh, select just click on select and you have to select for uh, this uh, zorin os or else just uh, uh, drag it and uh, drop in rufus and uh, write in iso image yes or no is there yes all data on device and uh, 16 will be erased see here whatever uh, pen drive you are installing to your uh, system it will delete entire data so before you are uh, placing a pen drive for your laptop or computer just delete entire uh, just copy entire data in other uh, device and then only you keep your uh, pen drive and after complete of uh, this uh, 
process booting uh, you have to restart your system so here I am opening disk manager in search bar I am opening for disk manager and uh, I will do two partitions shrink volume query volume for available shrink space please wait it will take some time Here uh, enter the amount of space to shrink. I am shrinking my hard disk. So here uh, I have entered some uh, numbers and now I will uh, 464.99 GB NTFS. What is NTFS? NTFS is new technology file system. So new simple and uh, now next and uh, okay somewhat time it will take uh, to shrink Formatting, okay. All the basic data partition. See here, I'll show my partition. See here, you can see C, D, E, and F. It's a new partition. Just now, I have uh, shrink it and uh, I have created one partition. See here uh, it has been completed. My bootable pen drive has been completed. And now I will show my pen drive. See. Zorin OS 16. See here we can see my pen drive has been completed. Name has been changed. Which was SanDisk has been changed into Zorin OS. So now I will restart my system. It will take some time for restart. See here we can see startup menu is there F1, F2 and uh, F9 everything is there and now see here uh, we can see start um, start uh, boot manager is there after starting try or install Zorin OS try or install second one is there save graphics and uh, try or install Zorin OS so Try, try or install your own modern NVID drives. 
so i choose second one and here we can see checking uh, md5 some 6 7% has been complete see uh, here uh, my display has been changed and uh, mountains has been appeared my in my display so if you people are also interested just try for buns this uh, zorin os is also very good because as you can see windows and mac and os will be separate and uh, combined uh, here we are getting everything so install zorin os is there just i clicked on it and uh, here uk english uk is there and english uh, us is there just i'll go through english us continue download updates uh, everything is there so continue just don't change uh, any of thing see here uh, installation type uh, install zorin os alongside so continue just go for continue and uh, install zorin os alongside windows boot manager is there so install now files 42 gb is there and 1611 write previous changes to disk and continue you cannot uh, do this operation so see here uh, after installation completed install zorin os 16 has been appeared and here we can see features of zorin os see here we can see each and every features new folder new document and uh, many features are there just see for settings power display mouse touchpad many are there graphics is there games accessories internet and uh, mines uh, see i am opening mines i opened and uh, just i am searching for what the advanced features which are there in it so it's an game new game files i opened and i am checking for files and uh, next so hope this video is good and uh, if you are interested in zorin os installation just go through this process and uh, install download and check for new updates and features so if video is somewhat informative and good please subscribe share my channel thank you